I'm CJ from Die Out. This is our bus. Come on. Yeah, this is our little rig. Bandwagon from Indiana. Uh, hook it up real good all the time. There you go. This is FIFA. This is like our fucking religion, man. So. I'm making a break. I'm making a break. So Joe Guerra, hold on, hold on, guys, hold on. Now, oi! Off the post. You shouldn't have shot, but you know. I tried to cross. It's all right. So yeah, this is what we do every day. We pretty much play FIFA. Oh, we have a number of teams. Sean at the moment is playing with uh, Manchester City from obviously England. Uh, Sean also likes PSG, which is Paris Saint-Germain from obviously Paris. Sometimes he gets down with Chelsea. Me personally, I'm on fire with Real Madrid at the moment. I too love uh, Man City and Chelsea. I play with Argentina a lot as well if we do international. But I just mix it up depending on where we are, who I'm playing, who I feel like playing with. PSG is another one, but yeah, we, we play with probably about 10 to 15 different teams between like all of us. We play a lot of music as well, a lot of classic stuff like Prince, the Kings of Leon, Muse, so many different fucking different things. Um, over here we have like some heads, we haven't quite got proper storage for them or cases yet. But this is an EVH which Marshy runs, he's thinking about at the moment, Marshy mixes up his heads. He likes using Diesel as well from Germany a lot. But EVH is uh, Messer Boogie as well. We have Messer, all of our cabs are Messer now. And Sean's uh, Boutique Bogner. That's a very prestigious head. Not many people are using them these days, but it's probably the best amp in the world. Over here we have um, our medicine. It keeps us strong. This stuff is space cream. Really, really smooth. Really, really tasty. Not too crazy. It helps you sleep, but it's not going to put you in the, in the couch. White lightning, this is legit. This is the good stuff, so. Super bright, super firm. Really like piney, almost like a citrusy in parts. This is grape ape. Again, super strong uh, indicas. Really, really good. Like water hash, so there's no chemicals in this hash. There's no butane extraction. It's just really fine. Really good body high, super chill. Do you know what this one, what we got yesterday is? Um, something, I can't remember. Okay, so this is like, I think it's all of these are from like our friends around America and uh, Denver and Detroit. This is a sativa, I believe. There's some bubble hash in there. Hash oil THE tablets, it's probably about 150 milligrams THC in each cap. So that is Easily like, good night. This is psycho shutter so we put that in Sm smells like super clean again pretty piney and uh that shit is like good night pretty much it's like when we've finished for the day before we go into our bunks basically for the people that know us and see us daily this is like our life right here let's do the fridge so at the moment our boys from detroit hooked us up with some barbecue chicken Thank you, Lance Keller Tattoo Studio. This is actually Ron's cooking. Hey, Ron. Ronnie. Ronnie cooked. Ron cooked this. It's so delicious. We got some good friends down there. Ronnie got that. Um, we have to clean out there. It's a whole bunch of kale, oranges, lemons, spinach, oh, some iced tea. We got someone's dinner from last night in there still. Spiced pickles. Now, Marshy, Andy, our guitarist, is right into good food, like most of us, for him especially. So Marshy went down to Whole Foods and grabbed a whole bunch of organic, like, cold-pressed juices, which we are obsessed with, especially myself. We got a whole bunch of different hot sauces. There's like nine there. Greek yogurt for when we do smoothies. I'm just, I'm new to hot sauce. Most of the band have been eating hot sauce for years now, especially the Leo drummer. Probably like about six months, nine months, and I just started fucking with hot sauce. But this is like super ghost in the darkness. I think that one there is um, really psycho. Like, I shouldn't really be, t I feel, like I'm a poser at the moment talking about hot sauce because like I said, I'm pretty new to it. But I think Lee got this one, this is from Africa. Ghost in the darkness, this shit is fucking hot, man. All of them are super hot. Obviously got Sriracha in there as well. We got some pineapple, we put that in a smoothie. I'm obsessed with pineapple, organic, soy milk. Uh, freezer. Uh, we got some Ben and Jerry's. Tanner, our drum tech, gets these crazy like pureed apples, and it comes. This one's raspberry, hibiscus, and green coffee extract. Put all this stuff in smoothies. Super, super good for you. Super tasty. Blueberries. Can't go wrong with blueberries. We've got some diced peaches. I freeze juice at the moment. I'm freezing some pineapple juice. I eat it when I'm like get off stage, and I'm super high. Frozen bottle of water. I like frozen beverages. I like super cold drinks. 
So that's the freezer is like my sanctuary for food, I guess. Uh, that's the fridge. Beerbong, this is for the drinkers. I'm not a drinker, but like Lee and Sean, Andy will occasionally get down this when he feels to be hazardous. Games, we've got FIFA, we've got Call of Duty, Sniper Elite 3, good game, very good game. That's, uh, we don't have Xbox 360 anymore. We got some DVDs, but usually we watch cable. We've got like 800 channels of cable on our television. We've got water. We got um, we got a blender. We got cups in here. We got protein powder. We got a toasted sandwich cheese maker. We got protein builder bars. We got some cleaning products in there. We had a massive tequila bottle, and that's tequila and mango. So that's gonna get saved for another good night. Um, basically, all of the drawers are filled with food or protein supplements. Or shoes. Any one of the drawers on the bottom is filled with Nikes. There's Sean and Kevin's Nikes. That's Marshy's Nikes and clothes. And uh, Sean's old Nikes. Uh, I don't even know where all my Nikes are. My Nikes are outside. And there is a stage shirt. I'm, I haven't used this on them yet, which I should have. I just keep forgetting that I have them. You just, I just opened a drawer and I saw them. So this is really good. It's our driver's washing detergent. And we do our laundry with that. Three soccer balls. Thank you, Rockstar. The boys hooked it up. They gave me two balls. They got like another 50 waiting for me to destroy, apparently. So I've got heaps of soccer balls. We use Nike ball. Everything's Nike with us. She is the goddess of victory. Yeah. Um, we got candles because it always stinks on here. We got cigarettes to keep us calm. We got a whole bunch of behemoth books. They're scales. That's for uh, weighing powder. I mean, flour for when we're baking so we can make good muffins. But yeah, Behemoth is like a big part of our band, so uh, we went and bought a whole bunch of the Behemoth new books. Um, sick, we got a whole bunch of pickups in here as well. The boys like to experiment, Andy especially. Pick a single dunk for the pickups. Single dunks. They're the boys. That's the front of the bus. It's just full of drawers. It's like a MIDI keyboard, hats, headphones. Again, Manchester City. This is given to me by a good friend in Manchester. He's a big fan. He's a good friend of the band, so. I've kept it in the box for him to, to respect the gift and take it back home um, the way that I was doing it. Uh, we have nine bunks here, so half of the band is awake. Marshy, Andy is just there, he's waking up, he smokes like I do, so lots of stickies. So Andy's bunks our tour month manager's bunk, uh, Clay. Mate, our sound guy, all round legend, is in the top bunk. We'll just see if there is a swag Tony Banderas. The swag Tony down here, this is little Lee. He stays in the bottom, he's like a bit of a bong goblin and a full-blown alcoholic. This is my bong, so I just got my bag, my laptop and a whole bunch of clothes and shit. It's like more weed containers. That's T-Sav, he's our photographer. Kevy B is our bass player. In the middle we have Sean DeLanda, he's up the front playing FIFA. In the bottom we have the amazing, incredible Mr. Tan Tan. He's our drum tech and also keeps all of our like spirits high, he's like a morale kind of guy, looks after us real well. We have the toilet, you can't shit in there, you can only piss. But actually, if you would like to see that black plastic bag on the side there, that's it's not shit. So there's no shit in it. Are you gonna get rid of it though? Ah, so usually what that plastic bag represents is what we call a hot bag. So you can't shit in these because it doesn't have the working plumbings of a proper toilet. You can only piss in it. So if you need to shit, you go in there, you put a plastic bag in the toilet, you put the, the, the bowl down over the top, you put your dick through yeah, with the bag, you say piss in the toilet, but you shit in the bag, then you tie it up, then you put the little bag in a big bag, and that's what we call hot bagging. If you're on the highway, you can leave it in there till we stop and bin it. Some dudes just throw it out the window. The bathroom, sink, uh, mirror, toiletry stuff. We got a shower in here. We try to have like super quick showers, like wet yourself, wash off, rinse it off. Uh, it's enough to keep us clean, so that's we're super stoked on that. But we shower at catering most days now. Uh, air conditioning, three units through the whole top of the bus. These things are unreal for bands, especially if you have like nine and ten or less people. It's a lot cheaper than a bus. It's slightly more expensive than a van. You save a lot of money, and you have all of the creature comforts as you would at home and you get to sleep and lay down rather than being in a van and being squashed and just hot and shit. So this is like a blessing for our band. I think this is the reason why our band is still together is that we upgraded to this. Our spirits are a lot higher, we feel a lot more comfortable and we can get some rest. Uh, Marshy's business bag, uh, it's a very expensive bag. 
I got a lot of them, very expensive things. We got a whole bunch of stuff from Rockstar. The Rockstar guys on this tour for Mayhem are the real deal kind of dudes. They're incredibly funny, super charismatic, super rad as fuck. They lay more chicks and dudes in bands and they party better than anyone else. So, big shout out to Rockstar dudes. These dudes make the whole tour. It's not even the bands anymore. It's the guys on Rockstar run around on motorbikes and quad bikes. Those dudes are fucking running around. <laughs> All right, so this is our bandwagon, as we've been told, it's called the Shot Wagon. But um, I'm CJ from Thy Art. If um, you haven't heard of us before, we just released a new album called Holy War through Nuclear Blast. Find us on YouTube, Facebook, whatever. Thanks for joining in on our bus. And for all the people who do know who we are, thanks for all your love and your support. And we'll be playing near you soon. So thanks for coming to see our bus. We'll see you next time. Peace.